My people, hmm, not be smart, you know, since morning, <laughs> na sad news, na you break internet, not be smart, you know, concerning the death of Ifa and David's son, <laughs> not be smart, you know, my people, make una carry on a joko, come listen to this man of God, this prophet, waiting in C, January 7, concerning family of David, <laughs> not be smart, you know, when he talk, say something won't happen for inside the family, and he can say they don't no respond to rendezvous, they don't no even answer because say he not be big that the geo say they not they hear he lame. Say they come in glory. But he writes the post when he posts on a platform say they don't no answer and now now say the thing don't happen. He say 2023 say I'm not that one. Say he get what he wants to happen. Say and he get what he want to talk. Say but he no talk and for online say he won't see the video may forgive and the remaining one say he pray for the family <laughs> say nah nah say wait till he talk the prophecy when he see january say he come to pass say um if i ain't safe if i may so rest in perfect peace my people not be smart you know <laughs> this baby when delete so even me i'm short of words this life eh, <laughs> nothing though this life is short oh. nobody knows tomorrow at all at all <laughs> may so rest in perfect peace so <laughs> how baby go day inside house people many for inside house almost eight people pekin waka come out enters with me poo <laughs> nobody see my people, you get us this thing, Bill. May you so rest in perfect peace. Okay, my people, make una listen to this man of God waiting in one tell the video and the word for waiting in see that January 7. Make una regade. My name is Prophet Samuel King, and this is a message to make more highlights on the prophecy that was given to David o on the 7th of January through my. Facebook account and uh, before I would like to continue I'd like to send my condolence message to the family of David Adeleke who just lost his son if I am not here to show that I'm the best prophet on earth which is one of the things I would like to be emphasizing in my prophecy highlight when I give this prophecy on the 7th of January I try to do some move to make some move but of course I am not among the so-called names of the big men of God in Nigeria who probably can speak to some celebrities. And if I had spoken, I would have been uh, called uh, one of the hungry prophets <coughs> looking, for, um, uh, looking for fame or trying to look for money. You know, in our days now, God is speaking, but many people have underrated and underestimated the word of God. So prophets have been abused because of a whole lot of things, misconception about spirituality, faith, and the prophetic. So I had to keep myself distant from trying to push because who would believe if I had said this was going to happen? And if you read that prophecy very clear, it said there are two clues. One has already been fulfilled. Two has already been fulfilled. The first is the death of David son. And the first clue, there were two clues said T and Y. The T stands for Thursday. And if you see all the happenings hap uh, right now, it just happened after the birthday of David O. And it happened, his son, which happened on Thursday, the 20th. So that cannot be a coincidence. The last clue, which is Y, is something I will not post. I'm not going to say online. I would in this very confidence would like to pass this message to Davido and his family. There is something he needs to know. I'm not out to get fame and I'm not meant to share this in public. I did three days fasting in obedience to instruct uh, the prophetic word that was given to me on the 7th of January. I received that word seven days before the 7th, which was on the 1st January night after the crossover night and i was scared to post it because i needed confirmations and i had it like three times davido i know this is a hard time right now for you and your wife to be choma i know that a lot of clouds and people are around you but i like you to hold yourself very strong and try to be in a place of prayer because the enemy 
is not happy about a lot of things that is happening in life. I'll send and I'll try my best to see how to reach out to the family and give you the last clue and tell you how you should pray about this. 2023 is another big year, but let it not be a mirror reflection of what has happened today. May the soul of your son rest in perfect peace. Now you will go to meet him. He will not come to meet you. Shalom.